All right, thank you for that shockingly dark update. Anything else? Uh, yes. Something I'd like to say. I'm a pretty private person, so this is kind of hard for me, but here we go. I'm bisexual. All right, I will now field one minute and zero seconds of questions pertaining to this. Go. Amy. How long have you known? Since seventh grade. I was watching Saved by the Bell, and I thought, Zach Morris is hot. And then I thought, Lisa Turtle, also hot. The fact that the words Kelly and Kapowski didn't just come out of your mouth is lunacy. What made you decide to tell us now? Charles found out on the road trip, and I was positive he was not going to be able to keep the secret for much longer. Bye, Rosa. I mean, not bye, but bye. I mean, see ya. I mean, have fun only having sex with men, just banging dudes left and right. I just stopped saying bye altogether. So are you seeing anyone now? Yeah, her name's Tiffany. Are you lying about her name so we won't look her up? Yes, I am. Next. Do you know Anne Heche? I do. Ooh. I must say, this is going considerably better than when I came out to my colleagues. They were not, as the kids say, awake. Do you mean woke? I did mean woke, but it's grammatically incoherent. OK, we have time for one more question. No. Oh. Nope, absolutely not. We're done. Smart. It was not tasteful. Donna, this is crazy. Typhoon is an artist, and the human head is his is canvas. Just listen, you're going to cut the man's hair, you're going to charge him $8. It'll take you four minutes. So just shut up and make the man look like this. Fine. Ugh. So, Typhoon, what do you like to do for fun? I'm writing an electronic opera about Brittany Murphy, and I do the chandelier design for my friend's drag puppet show. No further questions. All I really want to do is dance. Except lately, all the good warehouse raves are filled with Euro trash. Euro trash? I like that. It is indeed a garbage continent. Yes. Oh, my god. I had the worst time in Berlin last May. Everyone was on their stupid bikes. I was like, ew. <laughs> Please talk more about how you hate Europe and bicycles. Oscar, why don't you take this opportunity to officially come out? to everybody here, however you want to do it. Go ahead. Stand up. I'm doing this for you. Yes, I'm gay. And I didn't plan on sharing that part of my life with you today, so whatever. Can I sit down now? I'm not offended by homosexuality. In the 60s, I made love to many, many women, often outdoors in the mud and the rain, and it's possible a man slipped in. It would be no way of knowing. Who should be the judges and juries of our society? Judges and juries. Yes, that's a good point. She is a good point. Because gay marriage currently is not legal under US law. I bet a lot of straight men wish that applied to them. So they could go out there and have some torrid, unabashed monkey sex as much as they could. You know, sounds pretty good, right? That sounds great. Yeah, Dwight. I think all the other office gays should identify themselves, or I will do it for them. No one else in this office is gay. What about Phyllis? She makes absolutely no attempt to be feminine. I'm getting married to Bob Vance. You are? Oh, what? Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations. Oh. When did you get that? Oh, that's great. Congratulations, Phyllis. That is great and, frankly, kind of amazing. <laughs> See? Everybody has a chance. Thank you. But still, Phyllis, in college, did you ever experiment with other women? A lot of women do. No, and you knew me in high school. Of course, we all thought you were gay in high school. And I take that as a compliment. Well, with your ties and your matching well, socks. I just like your... to look good, OK? So you sound pretty defensive, Michael. No, I am just coming out myself. I am coming out hetero. I think the problem with this office is that you are sending mixed signals about my being here. No, no, no. The only signal that I am sending is gay good. Look, if I was gay, I would be the most flamboyant gay you've ever seen. I would be leading the parade covered in feathers and just, I'd be waving that rainbow flag. I don't think I can work here any longer. This has been the worst, most backwards day of my life. You misunderstand, okay. All right, blah, 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 blah. you know what, okay. Okay, I, uh, I'm gonna put my money where my mouth is. You ready? What are you doing? I am going to embrace Oscar. You might want to watch this, Angela, because you can't catch anything. Here we go.
No. We are going to make a statement. You and I are going to make a statement together. Oscar is my friend. I'd rather not. And I just don't care who sees it. I doesn't bother me. Really, would, would, I really rather not. Come here, I friend. really rather not. You're my friend. No, no. I don't want to touch you. Ever considered that? You're ignorant, and insulting, and small. Okay. Hmm. All right. Um. Sorry, Michael. I'm sorry. That was a good idea. Come on. Come on. All right. I'm sorry I called you Faggy. I know. I know, Faggy. I know you are. You're a good guy. Me too. Michael appears to be gay too. And yet he is my friend. I guess I do have a gay friend. You know what? I'm gonna raise the stakes. You don't we don't I want you to watch this. And I want you to burn this into your brains. I don't think we need to Because do this. this is an image. Then I want you people to remember for a long time to come. Whenever you come into the office, I want you to think about this. We don't need to. Yes, we do. What? <clears throat> oh. 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 I did it. See, I'm still here. We're all still here. Oh, come on, Dwight! Come on, man! What's going on? Family game night. Don't worry, I brought Twister. Hey, what was that? Hey, what was that? Yeah, there was the snacks. <sighs> you know, in another lifetime, you and I would have made a hot ass couple. Agreed. I guess you should be very proud of yourself. I know things aren't exactly where you want to be right now, but uh, I promise you they will improve. Thank you, Captain. Every time someone steps up and says who they are, the world becomes a better, more interesting place. So, thank you. I gotta hand it to you, Captain. That was some ceremony. It wasn't difficult. I simply said what I wish had been said when Kevin and I got married. And I never would have heard your hilarious efficient efficient quip. Mm, you're right. I regret nothing. Mm. But all this does make me think I might enjoy a more festive expression of our commitment to one another. Are you suggesting we hold an honest to goodness wedding? Oh, nothing too elaborate. We're not the Kardashian Wests, after all. They are a musician and a celebrity personality who recently wedded. Yes, yes, I know. They were answers on Jeopardy. I think you mean questions. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are fun. You gotta tell me about him. I don't know anything about him. Okay, he's 23. He's kind of my boyfriend. He's gay. Last year we got drunk and he took me to the ice capades and I didn't get him anything. And he's gay? Yeah. Brokeback Mountain DVD. No. The fellas love that. No. Does he already have, like, chaps? Like, assless chaps? Not, forget it. Okay, uh, why are you asking me? Because, I don't know, there's no one else to ask. And at least you're kind of young. All right, I'll tell you what. I'm gonna think about it. Through the course of all day, I'm gonna mull it over. It's all I'm gonna think about. But you're in good hands. I'm gonna come up with something really, really good. Really? Yeah. Okay. You got that? Yeah. Shushan. Shushan. Oh, hey. Hey. I've been thinking about your gay boyfriend all day. I have got some awesome ideas. Okay. First idea, spray tan gift certificates. Uh, no. Trip to Germany. Germany is awesome. And expensive. Good call. I didn't think of that. Okay, uh, you know how people say that you should give gifts that you would want to get yourself? What would you want? Easy, Indianapolis Colts Reggie Wayne jersey, number 87, double XL, home blue, signed by Reggie Wayne right after he catches a touchdown to win the Super Bowl. Okay, never mind. No? Hip Hop Abs Dance Fitness DVD. Oscar, would you reach over and touch his thing? That's what he said, right? Guys, because of gay. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>